Crosby's hearing. And that's when the damage was really done, believe it or not. He would have walked out of that hospital like Spencer Oliver did a couple of years later. Take that from me. That was a brilliant night. And Doug in Sligo, how are you doing, Doug? Um, I'm, obviously, I'm pleased you're listening. I knew you would be. Doug says, I'd give my missus right arm to have been ringside for Roberta Duran against Iran Barkley. Oh, easy. Uh, Doug, I mean, that's an tr- interesting one to choose. I mean, I'll, you, you can choose that one. There's so many of those fights involving those fighters that you could perm. Any way you do it, it's a good fight. Keep the emails, keep the calls, keep the texts coming. Um, thank you very much for, for bothering to scab. I haven't done you all ten, but those four, that's something to get going with. And Doug in Sligo sent in two. You're getting two emails tonight, Doug in Sligo. He says, Steve, can you tell what's happening? Can you tell us what's happening with Herbie Hyde? The answer in a single word is no, I can't, Doug. I have no idea. He is his own boss, Big Herb. I can't do anything for him. Sorry about that. I'd love to be able to help you. Okay, that's the way it works, isn't it? Now, I like this next fight. I like him a lot. He's an entertainer, and we like.